Hi everyone, it's Sylvia. How's everyone doing today? Uh, today here in Texas, again, in the hundreds. I'm a little tired. I've been uh, uh, house hunting, helping my, uh, trying to help out my daughter to find a place and it's not, it hasn't been easy, but I'm gonna continue. Okay, so today guys, we are going to do an unboxing from Diamond Art Club. And this one, I believe I purchased in 2021 because I am basically working on Blast from the Past. That's what I'm gonna call it, Blast from the Past. And it's basically working on your stash, or every month that's what I'm trying to do. So for the month of August, which I'm already a little behind, this one is called Femme Fatale and Butterflies by Kate Louise Powell. Okay, it is a round, as you can see. And uh, usually the round ones are come in this pinkish reddish color. And of course it says round on the top. It always comes in a very pretty box. Down here it says, scan me and unlock for 10% off. And then in the back, it tells you how it works. And of course, what's inside the kit. And it comes in three languages. So English, French, and Spanish. All right, so let's open this baby up. And what do we know about Kate? Well, Kate is an illustrator and she's also an animal activist. Okay, so let's see what else. I got everything in the box. Yep. Okay, that's the sticker. All right, so it comes. Well, this one looks like it's got the big sticker. Do I have a little sticker here? Hold on. Ah, that's what happened. The little sticker, I actually put it already uh, on the box. Okay, so that's why I couldn't find it. That explains it. Ha -ha. Okay, so the big sticker, here it is. Femme Fatale and Butterflies by Kate Louise Powell. And this you can put in your uh, logbook. And uh, you put the start date when you begin and the end date when you finish it. Let's move this over here for now. Okay. And then this is the old kit because it is an older uh, painting. All right, so it comes with resealable bags just in case you don't have the containers. So you could put them here, the drills. And then it comes with two heart-shaped wax. And of course it comes with a little uh, plastic covering. So make sure you peel it back before you grab the, the wax. And then this is the pen, diamond pen. And it comes with a single placer. So you could um, pick only one diamond drill at a time. And then it comes with another one. And this is a four placer. So you can pick up four with this one. And of course this is the comfort grip. Let's see if I can get it in. Yep, all right. And that's supposed to help with your hands for comfort. And of course, the tray. All right, so let's put this stuff aside. Okay. And of course, all the canvases from Diamond Art Club come in a plastic bag to protect it while it's traveling. And it says Diamond Art Club, do what makes you sparkle, but I always say do what makes you happy. All right, so let's open this baby up. Okay, all the canvases from Diamond Art Club are super, super, super soft like butter. They feel really nice. And they're designed this way to prevent wrinkling and fraying. All right, and they all have the, uh, the scallop shape uh, edges. And let's see, where are the drills? Come on, baby, come out. Okay, let's put that aside for now. So here we, come, here, uh, we have the step-by-step -step instructions. Thank you for your purchase, tips and tricks, and how it works step by step. Okay, we don't need that for now. These are the drills. As you can see, it says Femme, Femme Fatale and Butterflies. Just in case you separate them from the painting, you'll know that these drills go with that beautiful painting. All right, so I'm going to unroll it. Ooh, she's a beauty. Okay, and I love, this is a good size, guys. It's not too big and it's not too small. It is perfect. And the good thing is, I know I'm beginning a little late, just because I've been a little busy, but the lucky, the lucky thing is that August is a long month. Okay, so at the bottom of the painting, as you can see, it has a picture, and then it tells you again, DAC, Femme Fatale, uh, and Butterflies. It's 15.7 inches by 22.8 inches. It is 40 centimeters by 58 centimeters. Kate Louise Powell, which is the artist, Diamond Art Club. 
okay and in the middle it tells you take 10 for 10 percent your next order you can find them on facebook and instagram and then over here it just this is the lifetime warranty okay so it's got a 30 day money back guarantee it's got a free diamond spill insurance and 10 percent cash back rewards with every order all right let's open this baby up okay oh my gosh look how beautiful she is guys now uh before i continue yes here at the top it always says do what makes you sparkle diamond art club it has two le um two legends so one legend here on well, let's see let's move this back now because of the glare so it's got one here on the left hand side on the upper hand left hand side and then another legend on the right hand side on the bottom okay the legend basically comes in handy because it tells you how many colors it has so it says that it has 33 colors and i believe it has only one ab so you know what that means guys yep oh wait let me move it up and down so you see so it has one ab which is aurora borealis that's what it means ab and it just means this is drilled with an extra shine to it and then of course it's, like i mentioned before the first row tells you how many uh, colors so it's got 33 colors these are the symbols and the symbols is what you find in the painting and that's where you're going to place the drills and of course the dmc code and now let's look at this beauty now i actually looked up because i know that diamond art club had a little description about her and it says as delicate spirits of nature butterflies symbolize transformation and resurrection into new beginnings they bring hope grace and beauty through their feminine energy and exotic divinity so this painting guys it's beautiful uh you basically have this beautiful woman and you see her hair you see her she's got a very nice bun i like i noticed that it's got like different colors okay and then of course you can see her back back of her neck and then you see her shoulders and the butterflies are all around her and it sort of makes it look like she's like she's wearing the butterflies and as you can see it's like watercolor like the the butterflies are melting like the color the paint is coming down and um to me this painting guys is very elegant it's very romantic and the butterflies like i mentioned before actually when you look at it the butterflies look like they're coming out of the painting too you know um love her hair and the other thing um uh the 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 title femme fatale i looked it up and it had different meanings but i'm gonna i i picked or i chose the meaning that i think when i see this beautiful painting and it's basically a woman who knows her worth does what she wants is strong and powerful and unapp i can't say, i can never say the word uh, unapologetic yes that's what i think when i see this beautiful woman okay so let's uh well let me bring it up so you can see it it's got a lot of white around her okay so there goes her hair it looks beautiful i love that bun there goes her face shoulders is very 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 clear and the butterflies as you can see guys it has a lot of colors and the butterflies have a lot of confetti which means you're gonna have to change the drills a lot there and but the background it looks like it's the color white and that one is just color blocking all this in the background it's called color blocking and which means that it's gonna be the same color so you're not gonna have to continue to change the drills which is nice and also her hair looks like it's going to be confetti also all right so i'm going to bring out the uh the um the colors and and i'll be right back okay let's begin 154 is grape very dark 165 moss green very light 310 black only one bag 318 uh, steel gray light 327 violet dark 
333 uh, blue violet very dark 355 terracotta dark and 356 terracotta medium 413 is pewter gray dark 414 is steel gray dark 415 is pearl gray and 498 is red dark 519 sky blue very pretty 601 uh, cranberry dark 606 bright orange red 677 old gold very light 701 is green light 762 is pearl gray very light this is pretty 775 is baby blue very light and 799 is oh wait a minute oh i wrote it wrong this is like a looks like a blue like a blue violet 7.99 okay 818 is baby pink 819 is baby pink light 898 is coffee brown very dark 907 is parrot green light 939 is navy blue very dark 961 is dusty rose dark almost finished guys 3348 is yellow green light 36 3608 is plum very light 3778 is terracotta light 3799 is pure gray very dark and 3860 is cocoa and this is the white 5200 and we have six bags of these babies yep that's gonna be for the background all right so very beautiful colors all right so i'm going to move them aside so we can see the ab which is just one but you know what that means yep mm -hmm. all right so we have one ab which is a 124 it's a pink color uh, and again, AB just means Aurora Borealis and just means it has an extra shine to it. So we're going to bring that to painting and let's see where this one goes. I have a lot of pink in here. So, so now we're going to look at the legend and the legend will tell us that 124, you look at 124 and it's symbol one. So wherever you see symbol one in the painting, that's where this beauty is going to go. All right, let's see on her hair. Mm, nope. It has to be on the butterflies okay let's see so uh, where are you one okay i think it's down here guys yep it's right here right here ones ones and ones and some ones down here so it's sort of like a pinkish purplish color color um so yeah i am definitely going to add more ab's on this beautiful painting we definitely need to bring out these beautiful butterflies and maybe i don't know what do you guys think some highlights she already has highlights but just bring it out a little bit yeah so yeah i am so excited about this painting i love it um and i'm super excited because like i mentioned before i'm basically working on my stash every month or trying to all right, so I hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful rest of the, I was going to say the rest of the day, tomorrow, tomorrow's Friday, and hopefully I will do a kidding up. All right, bye-bye and thank you. Take it easy, guys.